Let's make a Dur legend uh, using images instead of real component views. So as you see here, we have a sample block with a component, uh, but let's make a copy of such block. And this block will rename that this is our sample block with images. So right now, um, we are going to delete um, uh, the block uh, with component and to, instead of that we will insert an image. So let's delete that and let's insert image. So actually images can be uh, taken from any catalog from your computer or your company server and the main thing is that image name has to be the same as family name in the project. So right now let's pick any image from the catalog and the tool will remember uh, that path to, to the catalog with all those images. So here we have right now uh, a block with the images. Right now let's select all block. Let's go into create edit legend. Um, here we we'll have a door legend. So let's pick door category. And right now uh, we have only family and count parameters, so let's add more additional parameters from the left side, from, from available parameter list. So it will be like uh, family and type, uh, name and width and height and door material. Also let's change the order of such columns. That's it. We have the columns we want. Um, still, we see that there are various uh, values because our doors are grouped according to the family name. So let's pick type name as well. Right now, if it's needed, you can make a filter according to the family name and type name. But right now, we will do that for all the doors. So let's pick a line that indicates uh, direction and let's select elements that will be arrowed down and that will be arrowed to the right side. That's it. The tool created a door legend with uh, the images from the catalog of my computer or it can be from your server. So right now let's rename that legend. It will be a door legend with the real images from the catalog.